Good morning everyone and happy Saturday. It's around 11 a.m. and I've had quite a productive morning on my laptop getting a lot of things done. Now I thought, you know what, I'm going to head out, go and grab a coffee and go for a bit of a walk around the city. So that's my plan for this morning. And then later today or tonight, I'm going out with my parents to celebrate their 25 year wedding anniversary. So we're going out for a lovely dinner, which I'm really looking forward to. I'm actually going to get my makeup done as well because I thought, you know what, it's a special occasion worth celebrating and why not treat myself to get my makeup professionally done. So that's what I'm doing today. That's the plan, but I'll keep you posted along the way and I'm going to film another weekend vlog. So without further ado, let's get this video started. And for today's OOTD, I'm wearing this Ralph Lauren linen shirt with my MIH jeans, which I bought from Netta Porter, my Chanel slingback heels and my Louis Vuitton handbag. So that is my look for today. Very casual, you know, Saturday vibes, but then a little bit dressed up with that heel there. So now it's time to grab a coffee because I desperately need one. So let's skedaddle and yeah, we'll see what we get up to today. When I think about the way we used to be, when I think about the things it took from me, I know that I am so Because I've been going to the gym a lot more lately, I thought I'd reward myself and I went out and bought some activewear. So I've got this really pretty pink jumper from The Upside, these leggings from PE Nation and also a sports bra from PE Nation. So I'm going to try these on and I'll show you tomorrow, but I'm really happy with this set. I think it's going to look super cute, especially with the pink. And this jumper is just super cute. It has a heart on it, embroidered into it. So... Yeah, I'm really, really happy with what I got actually. So, so cute. Let me know what your favorite activewear brands are, guys. Leave a comment down below, but I actually haven't bought anything from PE Nation before. I have got things from the upside, but um, it'll be interesting to see how these fit. I didn't try them on in store, so I'll try them on and let you know how I go. p.m. and I've just had my hair and makeup done as you can see we've gone for a very subtle dewy highlighted makeup look tonight which I love it's all about enhancing your natural features and it's very very pretty and then in terms of hair again we've gone very effortless very like soft look we've got some wispy bits dangling down with some curl in them and then we've got this braid which pulls back into an updo at the back so yeah very lovely look something different i'm really up for trying new things when it comes to hair and makeup and that's what I've been doing lately. I used to be all about that matte look but I've recently been loving that real soft dewy makeup look. It's something that I'm obsessed with so you know anyone else let me know what's your favorite makeup look and then in terms of my outfit I've got this Zimmerman dress on which I bought in the middle of the year for a July racing event at Flemington and yeah it's good that I'm getting use out of it again. I love the color and I think it goes really well with the hair and makeup that I've opted for. So this is my look for tonight. Here's a close up. I got 
got the risotto primavera, which looks so good. Dad got the fish and mum got the linguine. So bon appetit, guys. Looks so good. Well, you're I just got back from the European. I'm in my pajamas. I still need to take my makeup off, but you know when you get your makeup done and you just don't want to take it off because it looks so perfect? That's how I feel right now. It was hard enough taking my hair out of that beautiful hairstyle, but I'm in bed. I'm about to make a hot chocky and I'm going to watch some Netflix because that's my way to unwind before bed. So I'll speak to you in the morning, but good night for now. Sunday fun day everyone I thought I'd quickly show you my new set that I got yesterday at David Jones I'm wearing my new upside jumper with my P Nation leggings and my Gucci sneakers so a very casual Sunday look because today I'm having a very chilled out a self-care Sunday so let's go and grab a coffee come on and I've had a pretty chilled out day which is exactly what I needed. I needed a bit of a restful Sunday so it's been nice. I went out for coffee and I'm back home now. I actually just went to the supermarket. I went to Passion Foods in South Melbourne which I love and I've gotten some staples for the week ahead. I will go back there later in the week because they have ready-made meals that they cook themselves there with the organic produce. So I'll go back during the week and grab some meals. Basically, they all run out so quickly. So yeah, going back for some curries very soon, but I'll show you what I got. So I got this goat's cheese and sun-dried tomato ravioli, which is delicious. One of my favorite combinations and I love this brand. I actually haven't been to Passion Foods in a long time. I only went back last week after taking a bit of a break. I don't know why for a while. So it's good to be back with my favorite pasta again. I've missed this so much. And then I also got some avocado. I love having that for brekkie with some toast. Got my bread here. This is some spelt bread and I usually have so I'll have the toast, I have some avo, and then I have eggs on top. So I've got some free range eggs here too. I then got some green beans, some chewing gum, a zucchini as well. I've got heaps of veggies still in the fridge, so I didn't buy too many. I have some paka after dinner tea, which is great. So refreshing. I love this combination of herbs and yeah, it just feels really good for you, but it also tastes delicious too. Then I bought some dairy-free Parmesan cheese and this one is shredded. I thought I'd give it a go, try something different. So I'll let you know what I think, but let me know if you guys have tried any dairy-free cheese before. I'm very interested to see what it's like. I then got some basil pasta sauce. I love my pasta as you guys know and I love basil because it just, it adds so much flavor to any pasta sauce. So this is perfect. And then I got some frozen peas. Again, really good to add to any meal. I also stopped by David Jones this morning and got this drink bottle because I've been using a lot of plastic drink bottles and, you know, throwing them out. And I thought I'd buy a reusable water bottle and get onto that. So. That's what I got today as well. So that's my little grocery haul. Like I said, I'll be back there during the week to top up. But yeah, those are like my essentials on a week to week basis. So I'm going to leave this video here, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, can you please do me a big favor and give this video a big thumbs up and click that subscribe button if you haven't already. I'd love to have you a part of the Frenchie fam officially. So thank you so much in advance for that. And I'll be seeing you in a brand new video very soon. I'm filming a lot more lately. As you would have seen, I uploaded two videos last week. So I'm on a bit of a content roll. So I'll be seeing you very soon but in the meantime have a great day have a great week and I'll see you soon bye so we've got this I'm having 
blanks today. This is why I need a coffee. Now time to unpack all of this, the fun part, and put it all away. And wash this bottle. Fun. Adult life, right? I'm gonna shine.